Hello friends in this lesson we will be discussing about choosing a right college The college search doesn't have to begin and end with the name brand school There are many schools out there to choose from some known and some less known all worthy of your attention Here is some advice for trying to find the school that works for you. First, start with who and why you are going. You need to examine yourself and your reasons for going to college before you start your search. Find out your abilities, strength and weakness. Acceptation of life being something tangible or intangible talk with your family friends and high school counselors as you ask these questions these people who know you best can help you the most with this important issues second size matters most good liberal arts colleges have a population of fewer than 4000 for a reason College is a time to explore and a smaller community is more conducive to internal exploration. It is not the number of people but the number themselves and the kind of community in which you will learn that really matters. Many large universities have established honors colleges within the larger university for the same reason. third is name brand college not guarantee success you will likely find that success in life has less to do with the choice of college than with the experiences and opportunities encountered while in college coupled with personal qualities and traits employers and graduate schools are looking for outstanding skills and experience not college pedigree visit the national survey of student engagement for help on sorting through the information and for great questions to ask when visiting and choosing a college fourth no need to pick a major very few high school students have enough information or experience to choose a major You need the variety and depth of college course work to determine your interest and aptitude. Most college student change their minds two or three times before they settle on a major and they can still graduate in 4 years. Being undecided is a good thing and will leave you open to more academic experiences. Fifth don't be scared the truth is that the majority of the colleges and universities in this country admit more students than they reject if you are worried about your chances of getting admitted you will find that you have many options that will lead to a great fit for you be informed about your academic profile and compare it to the profile of the most recently admitted and enrolled class for the colleges you are investigating check the college admission website for this information and contact them if you can't find it sixth you can afford the college if you make the assumption that you can't afford college based on the sticker price of tuition you will miss out online resources as well as financial aid workshops sponsored by high schools in local communities are widely available to get you started college and university financial aid websites offer useful information and links as well investigate early and ask for help seventh when to start the college There is no perfect time to start college. Some students benefit from a year off to work, study or travel, and these experiences allow them to be better 
and more engaged students. Some students gain admissions and then defer their entrance. High school and college admission counselors can provide resources for investigating alternatives that may be right for you. You could apply for an internship, study abroad or participate in a community service project. 8. Choosing a fit college Finding a good fit requires time and thoughtfulness. Visiting college websites and learning about what events take place, who visits as guest speakers, and how to get in touch with current students and faculty. It is a good way to supplement a campus visit. Check a school's website to find the admissions officer assigned to your region of the country. Send them an email to ask about getting in touch with students from your area or identifying a few with interest similar to yours. When you visit, try to build in time to sit in on classes, eat in the dining hall and hang around in the student center or other high traffic areas. That will help you imagine yourself as part of the community. Talk to a few students and ask if they would make the same college choice if they had to do it again. Go back to the first item in this list as you consider the information you have collected about the colleges. You will have great options. This was the discussion about choosing a right college. Thank you.